Ross's role is um, crucial, really, that um, the, he looks after the tool that these guys need to do their job. Um, without the bikes working in perfect condition, you can't. it doesn't matter how good your bike riders are, if, if the bikes aren't working perfectly, then you can't win. So yeah, Ross uh, prepares and checks every bike, every race, and make sure that they're 100% tip top and uh, that the rider's got no excuse from, um, from material. Checking all the bikes, there's 10 bikes in total. So each, each rider has two bikes, a race bike and a spare bike. Uh, and then it's checking all the spare wheels, make sure all the right pressure, and they're, they're ready to do a quick wheel change if they puncture. I'm setting the front mech up, just get the cable tension correct so it shifts down without dropping the chain off. The only thing really with Durham was um, we changed some of the gear ratios on the cassettes um, to a lower gear for the hill um, and run the tyres at a lower pressure on the, over the cobbles. Just putting the race wheels in the race bikes um, so they've got carbon wheels to race on. Should give a nice change from their uh, training wheels. This is like a mechanic race at the start of the race. Be right. You know the work that Ross is doing before the event is hoping is making sure that you know nothing fails, such as chains, brakes, or cables, that sort of thing. But in the race, the worst kind of scenario we have is a crash, obviously. And once there's a crash and there's um, you know, uh, damage to equipment, then Ross has to be ready to change whatever's damaged and get them back on the bike as quickly as possible. And the rules in the Tour Series are that you don't get any laps out in the race, so it makes it more critical that Ross is on the ball and ready to go. It's good so far. Um, we haven't had any mechanical issues, so Liam Hollihan is up in the front of the lead group, five riders. Um, we think Andy's in a break off the front of the group, so it's going quite well for us. Well, we had a, a bit of a stutter at the start in Kakaldi. You know, we had a little bit of a difficult start with Ian. It, you know, you have to have a momentum, and with Ian's crash right at the beginning on the second lap, it didn't set us off on a good start. You know, with only five riders to lose 20% of your team on the first lap is difficult. So, um, you know, we went to Durham, got the momentum going, and um, hopefully we're continuing that tonight. The guys are looking strong and riding aggressively, which is all I ask for them. You know, we've got Liam in the front group, so we're represented there, which is what we needed to be. And then we've got, you know, the rest of the team in the front of the peloton, which leaves us in a strong position. You know, we've got strength in numbers at the moment. So looking good at the moment, but criteriums change by the second, so I hope I'm not tempting fate. Get in there. Get Move Next stop, we're off to Aberystwyth for the weekend. So uh, we've got the, the Tour Series on Friday and, the, and then the Continental Tire Sportif on Sunday. So yeah, big weekend for us. 